Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Just a quick video to highlight a couple of changes that Microsoft has recently made in Edge Canary. So if you are testing features in the latest preview version of Edge, then you may find this video of interest. Now, as I did post earlier today, we get the new uh, Discover, which um, auto hides now the a sidebar and I actually posted on that earlier today and I'll leave a link to that video in the description but over and above that key change we have a couple of others and the first is if we head to the address bar and we just do a search you'll see now you can filter your search and there's this uh, tab strip available at the bottom of the fly out menu which lets you now filter by history favorites or tabs so you've got a couple of options and if you click on the search filter settings the little gear icon that'll take you over to privacy search and services and you can actually toggle that off if you don't want to see that in the drop down fly out menu so if we head back and we just do another search you'll see now that that uh, filter your search has now been removed and it's just the normal uh, fly out menu you get uh, when you enter something into the address bar the url bar and that feature and this feature is not available currently in the stable version. I noticed it in my overnight update to Edge Canary. And if you want to pop everything back and, and reapply and restore the uh, filter your search, we just head back to the settings, privacy search and services, scroll right down to the bottom of that page, click on address bar and search and manage search filters. And there we go. And now if we go back and we do another search, you'll see that you can now filter your search once again using history favorites and tabs now with that out the way um, just to highlight a couple of other changes and these were actually spotted by leo um, over on reddit where microsoft has now restored a couple of flags that had been removed previously in edge canary so heading once again back to the address bar enter edge colon forward slash forward slash flags which will take us to the experimental flags page and the first is um uh, been able to mute a website so if we just type in sound sound content setting this is a flag that um, was removed by microsoft in edge canary and now has been restored so and um, that enables site-wide um, muting um, in content settings and tab strip context menu so as an example if i just right click on audio you can mute that site in the context menu and vice versa and also click on the little speaker icon in that tab playing the audio and then another flag that um, microsoft has recently restored uh, is being able to view your history with control and h on your keyboard without opening up the actual history fly out menu and this flag is uh, called enable history so just to get to that um, enable history enable history accelerator to open the full page enables the history keyboard shortcut to open the full page instead of the hub that's been uh, restored in edge canary version 111 so just to demonstrate and um, with that flag enabled if i use uh, control and h on my keyboard it opens up the actual history page and not the history fly out menu so that's a flag that's been restored and then um leo over on reddit has actually made um, a couple of um, a list of actually a couple of other flags available that Microsoft has uh, recently restored. Um, too many to mention in this video, so I'll leave a list of all those flags you can try out um, that Microsoft has restored. And as mentioned, um, uh, this was just showing you two of the more relevant flags that could be of use uh, that have now been restored in Edge Canary version 111. So over and above the Discover, we get the search in the address bar, the search filters, and we get those um, two flags that have been restored. And then, as mentioned, I'll leave a list of a couple of flags in the description that you can try out once again that for now that work. They may be removed in the future, but for now the flags work that you can try out if you are interested. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.